And we are back. You know, I had something I wanted to say. Oh, we're back and better than ever. Why? We're a few levels higher since the last time you saw us. And we got a kick ass weapon the Wazer Wifle. I'm not being cute here, that's the actual name of the weapon. The Wazer Wifle. It may seem like a normal laser rifle. But that's mainly because it shares the model. But anyway, it's actually stronger than the normal laser rifle. But that's not only the kick ass weapon we have. The other kick ass weapon we have is a glazer. Otherwise known as a gatling laser. This is more specifically a custom variant. Like it's got its own name, it's stronger. It's the strongest one. Strongest Gatling laser. There's three types. There's the standard, precision, and this one, the Vengeance. In this game, in Fallout 3. The precision has a higher crit, a critical hit ratio. Or percentage or whatever. Not sure what it's actually called. But the Vengeance like I have is actually stronger. So yeah. Anywho, making a move. I think it's time yeah. to continuing on the main mission and find out what happened to Daddy. So without further ado, let's start the clock. Not sure if you heard that. And start. Anyway, what the fuck with the? I just noticed it before I started recording. Every single person who has a gun actually has it. Part of me in the hand. Oh, gas. Okay, moving on. Crests. Oh, that's right, I was going to do that before I started recording. Oh, I could always do that later. But, uh, let's do this. Hmm. Light leg. Got a problem? Oh, what the hell is that thing? Good to see you. Hey, smooth skin. You need something? Ah, what the fuck are you? Haven't you ever seen a ghoul before? No. <laughs> well, not all of us got the chance to hole up in a nice cushy vault when the bombs fell. A bunch of us got stuck out here in the world and got a full-on blast of heat and radiation. Turned us into a pack of walking corpses. Near as I can tell, we age slower than you. A lot slower. There were even a few ghouls that were alive during the war. Of course, with a face like ground Brahmin meat, you can imagine that folks don't take too kindly to... Nice of you to say so. If you can't be nice, at least pretend, right? Fake it till you make it and all that. Still, though, a fake compliment is better than the usual spit in the face that I get. You're not half... Oh, yeah. I do remember a guy like that. Honestly, I usually keep my head down. I tend to get smacked around if I look customers in the eyes. But talk to Moriarty. Yeah, I could be in this, but... Moriarty's your best bet. I wish you luck. Moriarty. This guy's an asshole. He's essentially enslaved that lady there to be a... Uh... Woman of the night, and he's got that person indebted to him. It's locked for a reason. Don't get any. Colin Moriarty, at your service. Welcome to Moriarty's. My saloon, my home, my slice of it. If you've got the caps. My God, it's you. The little baby girl, all grown up. Persistent little flower, ain't you? Then and now, it would seem. It's been a long. Oh, your daddy passed through here, all right. Here and gone. Got what he came for. 
Is that what your father told you? That you were born in that hole? That he was born there as well? Oh, the lies we tell to those we love. Your father brought you to the vault right after you were born. To keep you safe, you see. I remember it well, you stayed in my saloon after all. That's right. Your father, his brotherhood a steel friend, and you, the suckling babe with nary a tit to suckle. Sorry about that. I don't want to kill him. Truly. Ah, but life goes on. Daddy lied. Life's full of little disappointments. Ah, I see. You know, I heard about the brainwashing that goes on down there. From some other fella, escaped. Oh, five years back. All hail the overseer. We're born in the vault, we die in the vault, and all that other. Kid, you've got better programming than our own deputy weld. You'd best wise up quick. Did he? Well, our time together was brief. Well, he did come through here, but he left. He headed southeast into the city. Ah, God, said he needed information from those loanies at the station. You know, Galaxy News Radio. What there is of it. Galaxy News Radio is some loudmouth radio station located in the ruins of DC. Three Dog, the king of that loony bin, keeps yapping about fighting some good. But I suppose if you wanted to know what was going on in the wasteland, that's the place to go. Me. And go we shall. Let's do a little quick. Oh, hell. Hmm. Quick travel to the closest thing. We will hit the rest of the way. Yes, do a quick save. Oh, I saved these guys earlier. Yeah, I did a whole bunch of missions, and if if you saw my mini map or my map, I went to a whole bunch of places too. Mainly to get some gear. Mainly to sometimes to do missions. This is where I got the little the ways of rifle. You'll see if you ever get there yourself. I've got the vengeance here, pain in the ass because as it says, there's death claws in there. I've only been to this area once in all my times playing Fallout 3. I've only been to that area once. I haven't even been to every single place in the map either. Mm. Mm -hmm. How is that line? You see it? You know what? I think I'll skip ahead here. I'll see you in a bit. Super fast speed, blah blah blah. Activate.
in here mostly. This next part I think is just a firefight towards it. Towards the station. I think. As I said as I said way back maybe in the first video. It's been a while. Help them very much at all. Stop. Damn lag, man. I'm not sure if you're seeing it, but I get a lot. I'm getting a lot of lag. Brotherhood of Steel. Look, I don't know who you are, but you don't belong here. The super mutants have overrun our brothers at the Galaxy News radio building. You can tag along if you want, but keep your head down and try not to do anything stupid. You've been living under a rock? This is DC. There aren't a lot of safe places in the ruins right now. Unfortunately, the building's been hit. The name's Sarah Lyons, Sentinel and Squad Commander of the Lyons Pride. We're with the Brotherhood of Steel. We do our best to hold back the super mutants in this area, but when civilians stumble in... That's a negative. We've got too many local conscripts as it is. Most are undertrained and too damn trigger happy. Our very own Initiate Redden is a... Watch it. Yes. Red, on me. You're doing fine. Just follow my lead. No dead heroes today, okay? What's the situation? All clear, Sentinel. Five mutants released from their torment. The rest are keeping their heads down. Good. Jennings? Negative. A new recruit? Just a stray we picked up. The one that blundered into the uglies over on 42nd. Welcome! Alright, it's the usual drill. Redden. You just do whatever Paladin Vargas says and keep your mouth shut. <sighs> Recruits never keep their mouth shut. I thought you knew that, lady. Yes, ma'am. But then again, most of the recruits that I'm talking about are male. Yeah, baby. Well, of course it does. Good thing I bought those all those electron packs. Yes, yeah, they am on for the for the I bought a whole bunch of them before I even got the gun. Why are you getting all this mess? I need to heal. Medic! No hey, medic? That's alright, that's all cool. I got nothing else to say. How did I say? What's the news right here?
By the way, enemies drop their weapons if you shoot their enemies. Of course they also drop their weapons if they're dead. Oh shit, that thing's gonna blow. Probably gonna sell those. That's bullshit. Yeah, yeah, we'll see. Now knock that off. You're wasting ammo. Ah, oh, come on. We just kicked their asses. We need to sweep the area. We're clear out here. Stand you think down. those were all? Yeah, <sighs> could listen to them. But I want to be able to carry shit. All the uglies in DC. You take the east side. I'll go west. Okay, okay. Once we're inside, then we'll celebrate. Now you're talking. Oh, you did. Oh shit, he's after me. Why the hell are you hitting me? No. And I've gone and killed myself. was the last sword I saved? Oh, I've gone and killed lions too. Well, that was quick. Hmm. I swear I was dead. I guess it's my turn to thank you. Anyway, the air. I'm sure. You can handle your. But let's not. I'll take that. If the brother. She died in the end. Mm hmm. Like it's all clear, unlocking outer doors. DNS. My memory serves me correctly. Once I speak to three dog, there's two ways I can go. I can convince him to tell him or tell me where he my father went, or I can do the favor for him. Let's see. Eh? There's a damn ant on my phone. D 
It was a damn ant on my thing. No, I mean, in real life, it was a damn ant on my thing. The look on your face says it all. You're wondering who the heck this guy is and why you should care. Well, prepare to be enlightened. I am Three Dog. Jockey of discs and teller of truths. Lord and master over the finest radio station. And you, well, I know who you are. Heard about you leaving that vault, traveling the unknown, just like dear old Dan, huh? Met him already. Hey, hey, one thing at a time. He heard old Three Dog on the radio. Figured I knew what was what out here in the Capital Wasteland. And he was right. So I filled the old man place. in. But he split. Looks like I've got my way of contributing to the good. Imagine a picture, okay? There's people out there trying to just barely make it from day. But then you've got all kinds of shit. Slavers, super mutants, raiders. They all want a slice of the pie, too. Well, holy sh... Since you know all about this cause, no need to... Oh, come on. You're a spitting image of the guy. He's been here before, and now you're here. Doesn't take a genius to figure it out. You want to find your dad. And it just so happens his location is known to your... But if you want to know more... You want to find your dad. And it just so happens... He was here at Galaxy News. If you want to know more... You... Good, because this isn't going to be easy. Galaxy News Radio is my baby. I love it. I feed it. I keep it changed. But there's one problem. You see, some brainless super mutant thought it would be funny to shoot at the shiny round thing on the Washington Monument. Yep, that shiny thing was our broadcast relay. Now it's Swiss cheese. Without it, our broadcast range is quite limited. Eyes are, uh, wait. Of course, the factory that made the relay dishes is long gone. I can't tell if his eyes are open as now. As in, we're never they gonna look scavenge here, that part again. But from this angle, they look closed. It is risky. But there's something behind those eyes of yours. Your dad had that same look in his eyes, too. One of the Brotherhood guys that passed through here mentioned seeing a dish in one of DC. It's the dish off the old Virgo 2 lunar lander in the Museum of Technology. I want you to get it, and bring it to the Washington Monument to replace the bad one. <laughs> You're gonna be the... If you need any more info... Huh. Interesting fella, three dog. And we shall continue search for Daddy in the next video. I have to see you there. Oh, why do I keep on talking like this? Somebody gonna listen. I mainly talk as a therapeutic. And I'm a shy person. I have absolutely no friends. And you don't need... Oh, I probably shouldn't have said that. Anywho, see you in the next video. Bye-bye now.